took me about three months to figure out what I wanted to do. Figured out, all right, I love cars. I love fixing them. Let's do auto. Checked out on a regular orientation what there is. And one of the counselors told me, well, there's a program here called CAA. And they need females, and especially females in the line, to prove what females got in this line. So I said, all right, give me the challenge. I was in a program, and they... This lady came and was talking about coming coming to college and stuff. I had spoken to a fellow from the EOPS program. I walked in one day, getting some information. They said, well, there's a meeting on Thursday. Come on in. So I came in the following week I was in school. My wife is actually taking classes in the automotive area. And uh, she told me just to come try it out. I come in and I went to an orientation, went over the program, thought it sounded great. But, uh, I had to find out about some grants, you know, and if I could be able to do it and still survive at the time. And, you know, I had to really budget, and uh, there aren't any frills. But uh, I'm determined and focused to make this work so I can better my life and have a career. The economy, the way it is, I can't find a job. I got in some trouble and stuff, and I'm just trying to turn my life around. I took a challenge on and just wanted to do CA. My wife turned me on to it, and I've been hooked ever since. It just happened that I got laid off. I figured go back to school. I guess, you know, I made a lot of poor decision on the way. I did like school once upon a time and I said, you know what, I'm been bouncing around jobs, bouncing around jobs and I was just, I was going home not happy at all. I, at the end of the day, to feel good about yourself, like you, know, you did something, you accomplished something. I just came back to school and ever since, you know what, it's been the greatest thing for me. The greatest, the greatest, I, I can't, can't lie. Just kept working and working and working. Now that I actually started college, it's like, whoa, why didn't you stay studying? I, I realized that I was so out of touch of, of what's really, really going on and which way the world today is going, you know? And it, it made me feel a whole lot better. Like That's why I say it's a wise decision I made. It got me back in a mode of focus to where I'm studying and I'm constantly thinking about figures and different ratios. And You look back and you wonder, you know, basically what have I done in my life? CAA is giving me the opportunity to, I guess, earn an entry-level position job. The learning environment here is really good because they teach you stuff that you're going to need. I was really bad at math at first, but now that I've been doing the math classes, I can read a micrometer and do division and multiplication a lot better than what I was before. I like the interaction and the hands-on training. I can learn things better. You know, it's not out of the book. It's not the same boring material. You're constantly changing up. You know, like our teacher in class, just he shows us different ways. Kind of makes us work through it. I'm always thinking, how does it apply to me? You know, how am I ever going to use it? I'm a type of individual like hands-on training. So the more I touch things, the more I do things, I'm, I'm able to learn it a lot easier. The computer classes, you know, I believe that helped me as well. So I'll be ready for whatever the future technology is. Then my computer classes, I advanced a lot on that one. PowerPoint. Excel, all that. Can work on a computer and almost fix it, pretty much. My resume right now, it's based on after this program. Focused me a lot more on the end result and what employers are, you know, seeking. It comes natural and it's going to be about welding. It's not going to be about just any old job. It's for my career choice. The more classes, the more better. Got me really motivated. It makes me want to do it more. It's everyday for everyday stuff, not just for the shop, just everyday learning, you know, about things, you know, about uh, resumes and about, you know, computers and all this, all this stuff that's always going to be there. And to have, you know, a, a good understanding of all this stuff really, really builds you up. A lot of teachers have given up on me a lot, but these teachers here, they don't. They understand how, how discouraging it is when you got to go to here, 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 and you got to go stand in line and then they tell you why you got to fill out this. If you don't have direction, then you kind of just stray and you'll just kind of drift, drift off and just get by. The instructors I have just have a wealth of knowledge which I want. When I first got here, I, um, I had to go to a math class and I didn't, I was, it had already started and I, didn't, I was, just didn't want to go and Tamar actually took me and walked me over there and gave me that slip and pushed me in the class, you know, and it's a good feeling, you know, when people, you know, put time into you and feel like you're worth it. It Bring your self-esteem up. Learning in groups is really good. Like I, like I said, I've met a lot of great people. It's like a little cohort sort of thing and we just help each other like a family. There's been a lot of camaraderie and first I kind of felt isolated but we've really grown together as a group and we work together and learn that way. As a team player everybody have you know, the point of view like oh, this could be the issue, this could be the issue, troubleshoot this, troubleshoot that. We are so tight knitted together as a team. We talk back and forth as if, if, if this, we've been doing this for years. We have stuck together from the beginning since we started. And that's what makes you learn too also. It's just I get up in the morning I know these guys are fun to be with and so I'm, I'm here. It always feels good you know. It, it does. I would have good grades and stuff like that and work hard for him. Now I'm telling my dad how to do things, and he's the old school mechanic. The feeling of bettering myself, making myself a lot better person in a complete, well-rounded way.
as well as an employable person. This is my first semester taking the CAA program, and I still got to attend the spring semester. So after I finish it, get certified, and hopefully work in automotive. Be in the uh, Pipe Fitters Union. It's all my own shop. Open up my own shop, hopefully with more females. Show them what a female has in their mind about cars. You know, the first time I was here, I, I got Dean's List, and I was just like, I was excited, but then I was like, oh, great. I'm gonna have to keep this up, you know, because I got, you know, anything less is, is gonna be, uh, you know, steps backwards for me, and I'm, you know, I, I just, I just want to keep moving forward. Um, it's a really great program. So I've never struck an arc at all in my life, and now I'm getting A's in this class, so that's cool. Right now I'm carrying a 4.0, which I've never ever had in my entire life. I feel that school is where I need to be at. I feel that there's a lot more things that I need to open up to, and a lot more things that I need to, I need to take in. Like not just as far as the program, but as far as just other little areas in school that I need to just to sharpen me up and, that, and then I'll be ready. I can't get enough of it, you know, I'm, I'm taking the next class. It's, it's never ending for me now. What we got is what everybody needs. People who don't give up on us, especially the ones that have trouble with the law stuff. Finance or, or life or whatever we could run into. I, I, love, I love where I'm at right now. I love it. Thank you.